Hey guys, it's Jada Mahogany. If you are new to my channel, welcome. This is a space where we talk about lip edema, health, lifestyle, and a little bit of fashion and beauty. And if you're one of my day one subscribers, I miss you guys so much. So as you can see, I'm back in my closet again, and it's because I went to Target today, y'all. I went to Target, um, just kind of like really looking for like the little cube baskets and i got to looking around and looking around and y'all know target will like suck you in it's literally a black hole it will suck you in so i ended up getting a few more things and i wanted to just do a target haul before i forgot like i didn't want to get like too invested into what i was doing for the evening and just completely forget to get you guys this haul start putting stuff up and then be like screw it so here we are. So if that's something that you guys want to see more of, stay tuned. Okay, so this is like a random Target haul. Nothing in specific. Um, excuse the way that I look. I Like I said, I just came from Target. I just picked up rain from my grandparents' house. So I'm like winding down for the evening to watch Ghost Power, whatever the heck, whichever one it is. I'm going to watch that. So let me go ahead and just get right into what I actually went there for. So... Um, my husband was saying like something about he wanted something to hold his belts or something like that. So I found this and it's a non-slip velvet tie slash belt hanger. And I think this was only like $5 y'all and it actually comes with two. So I'm going to take one and I'm going to give him the other one or I may give him both because my hangers are light in color. They don't look like this. So I got these. Um, and the next thing that I actually went in there for, um, was these storage bins. And I just did black and white because I just want like the stuff in my closet to be black and white. So I just got two black and white storage bins only because like, um, we don't have like, y'all know we're kind of like minimal with everything minimalist and um a dresser is kind of like a junk situation so i just needed two of these one to put like underwear one to put socks that's it i don't wear bras so there's that um and now to the things that i did not go to target for so i am going to be doing a video um doing my closet and i haven't done it yet but i will be doing it soon so i just grabbed a few things for my closet and the first thing that i grabbed and i got this because like i said i want to get back into doing like the makeup videos for you all like hair videos i have to do those in my hair room but i do my makeup in my closet i don't do my hair not my hair. I don't do my makeup in the makeup room. So there was no point um, for me to worry about that. So I just needed this. I just got like this three, um, this, ouch, this three tier cart. And um, it's just so that I can eliminate this. I had this in my other apartment when I actually had like a desk vanity situation where I was doing my makeup and I got rid of that. So this is just kind of sitting on my shelf. So I want something that I can just kind of put my makeup in, pull it out when I need it, push it back in, like no harm, no foul. I do have like some fragrances and some other things that I just want to take off of the, um, the shelving that is actually meant for clothing. So I did get this and this was actually under $20 if i am not mistaken and then sorry y'all the stuff is still in the bag because i like literally just came from there then i got four of these so why do i have i don't even need all four of them in my lap i got four of these i will take them take one out so you can see them they actually were in like the little dollar aisle or whatever you want to call it when you first walk into target and they were three dollars each they had some really like my target has some good stuff y'all so if i'm gonna put this i'm gonna try to put this video out like asap if you're watching this so it will be the same the same week that i record it will be the same week that the video comes out so you can go to your target and see if they still have these things so look so these are stackable i got four of them and i actually plan on using these for jewelry because my jewelry is literally like in a box and i just need something just a little more um just a little more organized so this just comes in and out and it's just white and they stack so i'm gonna stack 
those up and use those for my jewelry because it's just a hot mess in here and I can't do what I need to do in here with it looking the way that it looks. It's, it is a walk-in closet, but it's not like huge. Like it's just big enough where I can get my clothes in here, my makeup, my accessories, and a few other little things. Also, um, random, but when I was at um, my physical therapy appointment, um, was having lipedema, they're always saying like, oh, try to keep your skin moisturized, try to keep your skin moisturized. It just helps like with texture and just different things like that. My skin is extremely dry, y'all. And I know people gonna be like, use shea butter, use Vaseline, make sure your skin is wet when you apply things, drink water, do, I do all of that. Like I put everything on my skin while my skin is wet and my skin is just extremely dry. That's just the way that I feel like it has been. And with it being winter, it's really, really dry. So my um, my physical therapist showed me like a lotion that she suggested. And I used it when I was in there. And it actually worked really, really well. And she was just saying like when you get this particular lotion, it, says, it has water as the first ingredient. So um, this... This is not the exact one, but this is close to it. I didn't want to order it off of Amazon, but it's a emollient body lotion. And um, it's plant-based, cruelty-free. And of course, the first ingredient is water. So that was like the main thing, her saying the first ingredient was water. This is the brand that she had in there, if I'm not mistaken. I hope it is because I thought it was. And it is what it is. But I will let you guys know how this... Um, pans out my skin is just like so dry and i don't know what to do so we're gonna give this a try it just says maximum provides 24 hour hydration they did have a different one i think it was like coconut oil or something like that but coconut oil makes my skin dry so we're gonna just roll with this one and i will let you guys know um how everything pans out with it and if i would suggest it so there's that and it was $15.99. Yes, that was the price of this lotion. When um, when I was at my physical therapy appointment and I looked at it, it was $15 on Amazon as well. So there's that. Now to the good stuff. To the good stuff. To the good stuff. Okay. So next I got in the little dollar aisle in Target and these were a dollar. Um, these are... I need like some more of these for my makeup brushes because I've gotten new makeup brushes along with like my eyeliners and stuff. So I got two of these and I'm going to end up sitting these in my cart when I put that together. And like I said, back to this stuff, y'all. I feel like I hit the jackpot. Like sometimes I go into Target and then I find absolutely nothing. And then sometimes I go into Target and I find everything. It's like Heaven's Gate. It's like, ah, and I find everything. So that is kind of like what's what's in this bag um i got an exfoliating high high um hydro towel or whatever these have been around for a long time like it's not the one that i wanted um the one i could i couldn't find the one the old school one but this will do so i got one of these because i'm just like trying to um get my skin like really really smooth i feel like with having Edema, sometimes your the texture of your skin can be like a little odd so i'm gonna do a completely separate video on that just trying to show y'all like that business that stuff i have been looking for this for so long our target did not have it the last time i looked they said that it was seasonal but it's not mm, black girl sunscreen um i have been looking for this for quite some time and this is the Make It Matte Sunscreen Gel for the face with um, SPF 45. So I was really, really looking for this. If you are looking for a good sunscreen to go under your makeup that does not turn white, this is it. I heard. I have not used it yet. I will be doing a video using this soon. I had the Tarte Facial Sunscreen. It turned white. So there's that. So I got that. And then they had the Urban Skin RX Clear Skin Cleansing Bar for $6.49 on sale. Y'all see that? Yes. Um, I know the retail is more than that, but I've heard really good things about this. And I normally just only use um, black soap. So I'm going to just give this a try because I've been having like a little acne here and there. Then I'm going to show y'all what else I got. 
in the clearance section because your girl be looking for the deal um i don't know if you guys have ever used pixie products um it's pixie by petra i have used their eyeliners and their eye gel patches and i really love them so i saw this and this was six dollars and it's a beauty bomb um it's supposed to be a high coverage foundation we'll see I hope this color matches. I'm normally pretty good at that. The shade up was too dark. The shade under was too light. So we're going to make it work. And I'm actually going to do a full face using these products because I have enough to do a full face. So that's going to be a different video. Um, This was $6.60 and it's a shadow palette. And it looks like this and i love these little palettes for like travel because nobody wants to travel with a big colossal size palette like that's so play like makeup has changed so much and now it's just more minimal so all of that like big makeup palettes like you know big packaging like everything is is becoming smaller so i'm really really loving that then i found like this lash line ink this was seven dollars in velvet um cocoa and it's just a felt tip liner and y'all do not underestimate the power of a brown liner i know everybody's like black liner black liner the brown liner against the brown eyes just does something for me okay and this was seven bucks and then I did not open in the stores. So I'm not really sure what they are, but they were $4 and they are some kind of, um, yeah, cause they had the tape on it. They're some kind of, um, they're a liquid eye color and one is copper and one is like a green. So I'm going to do a video, a full face using those particular products, those brand of, brand of products. And last but not least, um, I got these because my girl makeup Shayla, I love her. I'm not like big into like influencers or really getting like involved with them, but she's one of my favorites. Like I genuinely like her. Like I don't know her, but I feel like I know her. Um, <clears throat> anyways, she used these products and I said I was going to get a few. So I did because I saw they finally have the whole line. So I am going to be doing a full video dedicated to um this product line and it's called jason moon so i got this matte palette this is like super essential y'all i love a matte eye look so that was number one i got that then i got the um the mascara the volume mascara volume and length mascara and i got a liquid lipstick in the shade honey fluff And I did get a black eyeliner um, because I did need a new black eyeliner. And I thought this packaging was super cute. It's a felt tip eyeliner. And then last but not least, because I've been on the hunt, baby, um, brow soap, okay? Now, if you guys are following me on social media or if you look at my pictures on my thumbnails, I really, really love a fluffy brow and i've tried some of the ones at sephora but they're too greasy like they're too greasy for my liking so i always end up returning them um and i don't like i hate returning stuff i really do but they're just like too 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 greasy so i end i end up using actual soap again so this is what this one looks like and um Hopefully, it works out well. I'm kind of disappointed that it does not come with a brush or anything like that. That's fine, but um, I'm going to do a dedicated video. I'll try to do an ASAP, but I can't really make any promises, y'all. But anyways, yeah, that was my random 8 p.m. Target haul. If you are seeing this video, I got these things within the, the week of me um, putting out this video. So definitely check out your Target go online and just see kind of what's out there because mine they definitely have a bunch of stuff on sale they definitely marked a bunch of stuff down more so in like the beauty department 
um, versus like, oh, actually, no, I'm lying. They marked a bunch of stuff down in the clothing department as well, especially in the kids section if you have children. So um, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss the dedicated videos for those um, two beauty lines because I am going to do full faces for both of those so y'all can see how those looks. And um, until next time.